We're here at FSU Commit, Josh Griffiths. Uh, Josh, just tell me what it's like to just be back here at FSU. It feels great. It always feels great to be home. Um, spending time with the coaches. I got to eat some chicken today, so that's always good. I like to eat. I did a little photo shoot. I'm just hanging out, watching the camp. Right. Was it the honey fried chicken? Yeah, honey fried. Was that your first time eating it? No, it was my second time. I ate like this time, I ate like ten pizzas. It was good. <laughs> What's so special about you know FSU, Josh, for you, and just why you commits are so close? It seems like you guys, once you commit, it's kind of over. Yeah, just um, the relationship the coaches build with us. Um, it's like a big family. Here. Um, that with the other commits, like we have a group chat. We'll talk about every day, um, recruiting other kids, and we'll just build a relationship with each other. Just, we get close. I, I know since you committed, you've kind of tried to get on that points competition. Zane and Jeff got going. Who are those, some of those guys, those whales you got your eyes on? Um, Mike. So that's me, Zane. Not Zane. Um, me and, me and uh, Jeff, we're arguing right now. If Mike commits, like, who's going to get the point? I told him I'm going to get the point because I go to ING and I see him every day. I'm always in his ear about it. But, um, Pretty much that. Yeah, it's a big competition. You would Redding a lot. I mean, what is it about him that um, that you like so much just being around him? What, what kind of type of player is Mike Redding? Um, what really sticks out to me about him is he's really humble. Like, he has all these offers, but a lot of kids, they'll go around not talking to people, but Mike, out over on campus, like, he's always that guy that's always out doing something. Um, he talks to a lot of kids, and he's like, he never acts too good to be like your friend or something, but he's he's one of the hardest workers I've played with. Do you know? Did you know he was coming today? No, I didn't. So, um, <laughs> so it was a surprise. Yeah, one of the coaches told me. What are you telling him about FSU? Um, well, he's from Pensacola, I believe. And mm -hmm. I'm like, just play a couple minutes from your house. I mean, that and like it's just a big family here. That and I think he'd be like a great fit here. At How are you feeling about that? With him and FSU? Um, I'm feeling pretty good, pretty confident. I think we're on him every day. We mention stuff to him every day. I think he's gonna, something's gonna turn out, whatever. I get you. What's, uh, is there an area your game really focusing on going into your last year of uh, high school? Um, just always working on my fast rush. Um, get quicker, better hands, pretty much the two things. You had a really good spring when I went there. I mean, really good practice. Uh, what have you done differently with your game now, you know, compared to last year? What are you much better? Because you told me I didn't know any moves, and now you know a lot yeah, of moves. When I first got there, I only knew, like, one or two moves, and then my coach, he taught me a lot of stuff. I transferred my power in the weight room into the field. Um, that and just technique. Technique will get you far in football. Like, you dominate with technique. So that's right. What I pretty much and then lastly, uh, what other recruits are you talking to, Josh? Um, Who are you? Where are you from? Coco. Okay. Pretty much done to Okay. Thank you, Bob.